the man from the sperm drum? Slowly show one by one and we see what's like it. Because I think seriously there's some, kind of, some missing information in your okay. assessment. Yeah. Can you show me Surah 112? Mm -hmm. Surah 112, you may be knowing. Yeah, Lam Yalit Walam Yulat. Yeah. So he's not born. No, Arabic, your training is Arabic. Don't say Quran Arabic. Quran is in Arabic or what language is the Quran? Quran. No one knows. Arab says it is in Arabic. Arab says. Do you know who you are? That's what no one knows. <laughs> I know. Arabic no, trainer, okay. Arabic trainer, trainer. If you, if you don't know that the Quran is in Arabic, then you've come no, no. to the wrong planet. Then, Which planet are you from? Listen, listen, listen. Ask him what he's now, trying to now, say. Now, Allah, when you, how you Sorry, got Allah, how you got Allah, they say Semitic language, wait, 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 Hebrew, wait, wait, wait. Slow, it took from... You're, you're jumping all everywhere. That's what no, he's no. doing. Because, now, one moment. Okay. Is the Quran in the language of the Arabs? That is Arabic claims. Arabic claim. Arab claims that it is Allah's language. They gave me the Allah. I don't think you understand English that well. Okay. Enough, right? You understand. Oh, you understood. I am not. I am not speaking you English. English. You speak English. You speak English. 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 You speak English. I think so. Oh, then, then you understand this. That Arabic trainer trained you that. Um. Listen. Yeah. The Quran yeah. is in the Arabic language. Who that disputes is a claim. that? Who that disputes is a claim. it? That is a claim. Arabic claim. Uh -huh. Who disputes that the Quran is in, not in Arabic language? Okay. Okay. Yeah. Who what? disputes that? What? <laughs> I don't dispute. I said <laughs> Arabic trainer trained you to say that. Who's, who told you Arabic trainers trained me? <laughs> you took from, training from whom? Oh, you so you know who trained me, did you? <laughs> That's who trained me? Okay, who trained me? The Arabic me? trainer. Eh? You're mistaken. I have been trained by various people, Arabs and non-Arabs. Arabic right? trainer One trained you. The Arabic trainer trained you. In fact, you. my first Arabic lessons were with... Yeah, you took some Arabic lessons. Yes, that's what I said. You, Arabic Did you trainer? not hear what I'm saying? No, it was Arabic. not an Arab who trained me in Arabic. So now... He was Arab your, trainer. Excuse me. I'm asking you, simple. If you dispute that the Quran is not in Arabic, yeah? if you dispute it's not in Arabic, where do you get this from? Surah 16. No. Where do you get these claims from? It seems like very, very strange. You know what, you know what happened? I, I think the point he's trying the to make Arabic is trainer, even the word, Arabic trainer, the Arabic thing Arabic is trainer an trained you to say that way. Now, Arabic trainer trained this man to translate. He said he created man from sperm drop. He means Allah in Surah 112. Say he is Allah. Wait, 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 wait. wait. Who is he? Wait, is this translation hmm? correct? Okay, let's take it. I'm asking you. Do you want any other translation? I just took... I'm, I'm simply asking you. Is this Arabic correct? First of all, is it Arabic or is it Chinese? I don't know. That's what I'm saying. I'm not an okay. Arabic. I, right, I not right, right. took the training in Arabic. Listen. I took the then training. I, I suggest you actually get some basic training in Arabic. Okay. Basic to training. Understand basic training. The Quran is in Arabic language. Says, Allah created man from sperm drop. How Allah removed the sperm drop? You have to that's the, that's the you big have to thing. understand the Arabic language first before you can tackle the food. <laughs> See, another trainer. No, no, no. He, he doesn't you understand. understand. You don't understand. You understand English. If he created man yeah. from sperm drop. How, uh, who is it man created from yeah, Allah's so the Arabic sperm? Arabic came before the English. Allah's sperm. Do you know the Quran says... Who is this man created from Allah's sperm? Listen. So, your comprehension skill seems to be to such a level that... So what such a level? It's the simple can I, English. Can I finish? Simple English. Simple English you don't understand. Listen. Do you want me to speak Oxford English? Listen. Yeah, please do. Go ahead. Oxford English, please. Yes. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Speak in Oxford English. Oxford English. English. But he asked questions. He yeah. created another uh, translation. Well, it's created from Nufta. What is that? No, he's speaking Oxford Nufta. English. Nufta. It's Oxford English. Can you speak it's, Oxford it's, English? This is Oxford. It says Nufta now. Do you know where Oxford now, is? Up, Nufta is in... Do you know what an Oxford who English is? is? This, who is this stupid person who translate Arabic and he uses Nufta? Nufta? Nufta Nufta? Do you need glasses? Yeah, because it is sunny. Yes? Sunny, okay, no problem. No problem. Yeah. Right. Yes. So let me tell you something. Okay. Allah says, بَدَأَ خَلْقَ الْإِنسَانَ مِنْ طِينَ ثُمَّ جَعَلَ نَسْلَهُ مِنْ سُلَالَةِ مِنْ مَهِينَ he began the creation of man from clay. Then he forgets. Again he forgot. Um, Allah, 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 said, Allah said in Surah 16. Are you going to cut me off? You don't want to let me finish. Okay. Okay. I'm okay. only halfway through. Yeah? Just take a little bit of break. So Allah began the creation of man from clay. Then he created his progeny from the sperm drops. From something that is emitted. Okay. Okay. So okay. I'm okay. not finished. You finished? Not finished? No. Okay. Do you have any something called patience? No, we, in Oxford I, English, I there's a word called patience. What list you left? Let me finish oh there. My God. Thank okay. you. Patience. That's in Oxford English as well. So, Allah began the creation of first man 
from clay. Then the progeny came from the Nutfa, Mimma in Mahid, from this water gushing fluid. That's how the Quran explains. It's done, or can I? Now, you broke Allah's promise to protect Quran. He now removed another meaning for the simple language. He created man from sperm drop. Now gushing, he added gushing. Now Allah promises nobody can change the Quran. He now put another thing. Allah forgets what he said earlier. He created man from the man from the clay. Then he forgets in Surah 16, 4, that he created man from the sperm drop. He create, he removes the sperm drop and create a man. Who is that man? You don't know. But you want some Arabic trainer trained you to say this. The gushing. Surah. Can okay. I? Wait. No, I will, I will wait. Finish. 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 I want to know which English Patient. trainer trained you. Patient. Now here, here. Because that's very important. Here, the Surah 16 verse 3 and verse 5. Yeah. If you read, he talks about the other cow and the kettles. Yeah. Now here, you don't know, now you have started adding your own stories to the Surah 16.4. Who is that man? It's the simple question, who is that man Allah created from the sperm drop? Sure. Who is that man and who, where, sure. from how Allah removed the sperm? So, can you now tell me who trained you in English first? And then I'll uh, continue. There, there are uh, many people. Many people. Anyone English who trained you? No. No problem, no problem. It doesn't have to be an English person to train English. Yeah, so, exactly. so, so, is it relevant then to bring these issues about Arabic trainer, Arabic trainer? It's because irrelevant. Trained, uh, wait, wait. No, my, it's my irrelevant. Point. Just like in your case, who trained you in English is irrelevant. Whether it was an English man or a woman or non-English person, it's irrelevant. What's important is we should have some kind of comprehension skills of what we read. I just told what I told you in the Quran earlier on in Arabic is actually from the Quran. So Allah gives the context. He tells us the creation of first man and then the creation of the subsequent progeny. So here he's talking about the creation of the subsequent progeny from Adam alayhi <laughs> salam. You're making did you, fun did you, of did, Allah. Did you understand Allah, what I said? Allah, Allah, say, simple, Allah say in a simple language. Allah, if Allah is God, says in a simple language, He created man from sperm drop. He has everything, whatever you have in the pocket. Add it. What Arab trainer trained you? Add it. Arab it's trainer, it's, it's a simple, I, I simple, I think simple I'm really, language. I'm, I'm not speaking, I'm uh, hearing English enough. English? What's Who's he trying to say? Who is the English guy? One I second. Think, uh, I, I, I yeah, English? yeah, yeah, yeah. You need some English person. Yeah. I could What's be wrong, all right? Yeah. So, but he, he started off from uh, two concepts. So one of the concepts is that, like, you know, he said, who created Allah? He said, if Allah exists or not. And who created exactly is Mula? Is that Mula? The creator. Bulla, Bulla. Okay, Bulla, creator was a horn. It's imagination. A tail. Not imagination. Created it. It's like Allah, Allah is, is the imagination of Arab. He's trying, uh, I think the point he's trying to make is like, you know, both of them are abstract concepts being told. You speak English, you speak English. While we were growing up or English, something. English, like English, English. So that's the first step. Not your English, perhaps. Uh, uh, I'll and then I didn't understand what, hmm? what he's trying to get at. That's the first thing yeah. he said, but I didn't understand what he's yeah. trying to get so at. So I think fundamentally the yeah. problem that we are facing here is this. You have, of course, some questions. It's not a good question. It's a simple, simple, yeah, simple yeah, verse. And how really Allah know, forgets like, listen, in Surah 112. Listen. It's either added, Surah 112 is added. I think you're forgetting what I just said. Right? Oh, okay. I what I said, let's come to you. I want to know. So as I said, that, yeah. Allah talks about the creation yes. of various things. Yes. He talks about creation of humans, creation of human beings. He actually gives us in various phases highlighting the important things that have been associated with the creation of man. Where it okay? says in Surah 1 um, I'm not talking Surah, to you, Surah, I'm speaking to this gentleman Surah, here. Surah, Surah so, 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 be you quiet. Adding, in English language, there's a word called quiet. You are quiet. Adding. So, be you are, quiet. You are blaspheming. Uh, if it is a Quran, it is a word, you, word of can God. You, can you be kindly quiet? Thank you. Now, so Allah says, He began the creation of man from clay. So, we now have. Even the phases of human creation, they were very first of the human. Allah says he created from clay. And he talks about how in various clays, Salsal and Kal Fakhar, for example. Salsal. So the various stages of even the first human creation is explained throughout the Quran where it's needed to explain in detail. Elsewhere, Allah says, as a human, created human, which is the progeny of the first human. Where? Because, it is from the pocket. Um, you are talking patience from the pocket. Patience and be quiet. Thank you. You are talking, so now, talking from the pocket. 
Uh, are you going to let me continue with this? No, no, UK, UK, excuse me, UK, UK, so, I was okay, discussing. I'm going to ignore UK, him, right? You, uh, and the background noise. And add, so what is this? So Allah says, Thumma ja'ala naslahu. Then he made his progeny from, and then he gives you what this process of creation is. The process that are, mimma in mahin, a gushing fluid. And Allah says, this gushing fluid called alaqa. What is not the, the, the alaqa transforms in something called mudgha. Mudgha transformed into idham. The idham is lahm, kiswa bil lahm. And then from it, khalqan akhar, another creation, because it's a different form of the human embryo as it develops. You must read Quran. So you must read when Quran. We, when we, when, when, training. listen, Arabic when training. the Quran it's Arabic uses, balls. Use the terms to describe the creation of man. Wasting the from the topic. Is the some most point, topic, the topic is some places topic. you describe at length. Other places only highlighting one key word, like خلق الإنسان من ألق. Just one word. Very importantly, why ألق? Because Allah is trying to make this link of this word to the context of the discussion within the surah. ألق in the Quran, in in Surah Al-Alaq, for example. Only one place, Iqra, Bismi Rabbik Alladhi Khalaq, Khalaq al Insana Min Alaq. And Allah continues, Iqra, Rabbuk al Akram. One word is highlighted, but elsewhere Allah talks about in Surah Al Mu'minun, for example, how He created from Nutfa, as I said, Mudgha and so on. Alaqa Mudgha and so on. So these are the ingredients of creation of the first human beings and His progeny. If I told you I created bread from flour, you don't say, oh, that's wrong. Bread is created from flour. But if I said bread is created from flour and water, that's also true. Because I'm just adding you different ingredients to highlight the detail when I'm trying to explain to you a certain process. Um, when the Quran describes, likewise, now, now, yeah, this is, this is, this I'm is not talking now, to you. Now, when the now, Quran describes, he was talking to me. He was talking to me. You would came like in to and hear. He is trying, trying to fool you. He is trying to fool you. He is trying to fool you. You see, you see this. So when the Quran simple English describes the story of certain prophets, sometimes it describes one aspect or two aspects of his life. Elsewhere, the same prophet is described in detail. His life, his mission, his teaching. Arabic trainer made you to understand. You cannot simply take one part and say. It contradicts to the other part. When you God don't understand the Quran, like yeah. it's simply uh, total don't understand this. understanding yeah. or not you understand comprehending this? the language of the Quran. This? And it's I, I think with a simple language, man created he, from the he, sperm uh, drop. How question, the sperm is removed? The question, how Allah so, removed you know the, the sperm? Process, I don't know how the process works, but uh, would, would it be like um, a literal <laughs> process or a mythology? Explain. Sorry? Explain. The process of the creation. He is a repeating Arabic. Uh, he's a, a like repeater. He's a repeater. How would you say that? He's a repeater. How would you say that? I've understood you. I've heard your first statement. What word for word? Or you deny him. He's denying the Allah's word. You're denying Allah's word. You're denying Allah's word. Yeah. Okay, yeah. go ahead. Um, uh, you know the, the process in the Bible. Come here, come here. No, this is. He had. So I want to like, uh, trouble this. Quran and it, uh, he had the. He had, had my conversation. But, um, uh, Allah created of, uh, man from the sperm drop. Right? How could the sperm you, is removed. You, how the sperm is removed. Could you stop shouting in my ears, right? So how Allah is removed. Okay. We're going to move on. You came. Don't follow me. Came, Thank you very you much. You came. No, you you're, going to, you're dictating. Go to Iraq. Dictator, go, go to Iraq. Iraq. Go to Iraq if you're dictating me. It is a, it is a speaker corner. Don't dictate. Don't follow me. I don't want go to talk to, Iraq. to you. I want to talk to this gentleman. You came and uh, spoke okay. to me. No, no, I'll ask you a question. Okay, you know what? Uh, ask, ask, ask me. I will, I will as well. Okay. I'll ask you a question. If you are interested, I'll be just there. Can you finish with him? Then I'll talk. In the camera. In the camera. Because I, uh, I cannot why, uh, continue why, uh, talking with you, you running away? while someone running away? is shouting in my ears. Why are you running away? Why are you in the middle? See you later. Goodbye. Goodbye. Oxford English, goodbye. Look at what it means. Arabic trainer, explain me in Arabic. Explain me. Explain me. Arabic trainer, explain. Goodbye means what? Why are you following? Exactly. It's not Iraq. Don't stop. Don't record. Because why would you speak to the gentleman? Uh, I'm, he's running away now.
running away. He's running away. He's running away. He's running away.